Hello folks, it's Gameplay Horizon here and welcome back to my channel. I just want to share some gift code for you and to try your luck in the event. I already got my first Ampu by rolling those roses one by one and not by tens. The probability of getting your selected triple S hero is 2.17% which is higher compared to limited ticket summon which is 1.41%. And here it comes, Anpu appeared from nowhere and I was not surprised because I really did expect him to appear. This is already my second Anpu from this Valentine's Day special summon. If you haven't got any, I would suggest just giving a try to summon one by one and maybe who knows, you will get lucky. Three more days left in this event and I would suggest getting those roses as much as you can. In the Petal Exchange Shop, the best items in the Valentine's Day Exchange Shop are the Gene Hybrid and Gene Mutation 2 Crystal. Red runes are also good, but the exchange rate is so expensive, and if I were to weigh it, it is not cost-effective to buy it using Rose Petals, and still Gene Hybrid and Gene Mutation Crystal 2 are the best. Anyway, that is only my opinion, and you will have the free will not to follow my advice. After a few weeks of waiting, at last, my friend Turks already released his very strong summoner team. Turks is no ordinary player. This guy is very strong, and if you recall in the summit arena, he ranked second place. His Daniel, Skuur, and Hattie and Anpu are already at EX30, and his Muka and Sorvali are at EX20. This is my first time to test my Vanguard heroes attacking the summoner team and all of my heroes here are at EX30 except for the hero Nafing. So far, this is the best team that I have tested in countless battles in the arena. Now I am quite excited to initiate the attack using Vanguards because last time, it was the opposite. No one dared to show up their summoner team. Now, let's test my Vanguard team versus the Summoner team of Turks and see how it goes. In this kind of setup using Vanguards versus Summoner in PvP, I think there is no need for a healer support here in the Vanguard team. If you will analyze this, Masrani cannot catch up to heal Crete and Leo or any other heroes versus the damage received by heroes. The healing versus the damage of bombs has a huge difference making Mishrani's healing skills useless. Leo only survives because of his damage immunity and although I won in this battle, you should not trust this because the next step is to test this using skipped animation and maybe I won because of RNG. Now I will battle again using skipped animation and let's see the result. I did this already over and over again, maybe around 40 battles, and I only won 8 times. I have tested many hero compositions to counter the summoner team and this next battle is the best team so far that I have tested. This may not be the best, but it is worth trying. I replaced the hero Misrani with Luke and the build for Luke should be the ultimate critical build and please see the end screen video for further explanation. Summoner heroes have very high HP in any PvP arena and their defense and damage reductions are low. So, it would be best not to use Luke with pure damage because pure damage is best on enemies with high defense and high damage reductions which bypass or ignore defenses. That is why I recommend Ultimate Critical Luke. To make this simple, critical attack is to high HP while pure damage or true damage is for high defense or high damage reduction enemies. Now, I will repeat this process over and over again. I did this already about 50 times and honestly the result is still the same. Take note that this is only to give you insight in playing the game, most especially in the arena. Special thanks to BLC F2P and company for giving some best insights and strategies in playing the Valentine's Day event and hats off to you. Until then, thank you. See you in the next episodes. Losing time, I'm fading fast.
past I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to Still watching at this moment? I also have a test using Guan Yu. This team is solid too and you can try this team even better than the previous team. You can also use for Vanguard teams and the Hero Luke. Try to watch these gameplays. I will give more insights as soon as I test more hero combinations. Thank you again.